Okay, so as we know, Dream has ended the Manhunt series, and honestly, those are the most legendary series on YouTube. Honestly, I would want him to bring them back, because, like, they never really got boring. Like, they're actually so entertaining, like, any way he puts it, anything he does, it's, it's just so different. A lot of people might say, okay, oh, they're just the same thing, the same thing. Well, that just means that the person isn't really into the game that much, honestly. Because, like, if he actually did another Manhunt video, for example, with, like, six hunters, I would still watch it because honestly i think it's it would be very entertaining there would be probably a lot of different stuff that he'd do and I, I actually find it very entertaining but as we know jim has ended the manhunt series and he isn't gonna really post any more manhunt videos and as you know six days ago he uploaded a video called minecraft 100 floor survival now as we see the views on his video compared to like his manhunts and stuff are very very low obviously 6.6 .6 million views ain't a joke like i'm not saying that it's just comparing them to his other videos they are very very low now the question rises is dream like actually killing his channel by posting this type of video let me give you a short answer yes but now hear me out i'll explain why basically for an example if you look at dream's video called minecraft speedrunner versus two assassins it's not a manhunt video it's kind of similar style but it's just not it and it has 21 million views now one video before that called minecraft speedrunner versus 500 Hunter's rematch hit 70 million views. Like 70 million views is something that Dream was getting on every single Manhunt video over the last like what two years. But then we see his next video that is Minecraft Speedrunner versus two assassins gets 21 million views, and that is like one fourth almost of his Manhunt videos, which is a huge drop. And and then after the Minecraft Assassins video, he uploads another Manhunt video just as good as the previous one that got 70 million views, and that one gets 30. 34 million views which is more than half less even though the video that got 34 million views should easily get 70 now you might be asking what's the reason how and why did this insane drop of views occur well it's pretty simple you know as soon as you upload something that youtube's momentum doesn't really like which is like an assassin's video which is like 16 minutes long which you know youtube doesn't really like this change in time when it comes to your consistency on your youtube videos it really just doesn't push out the video that much as we can see 21 million views and then he uploads his next video and it gets half the views of his previous manhunt and the reason for his manhunt video to perform that bad is because of the reach in the previous video which kind of maybe sounds confusing but you can look it up if you want so what i'm saying is now that he has uploaded minecraft 100 floor survival and it got low views his next video will probably get even lower views obviously depends on what he makes but if it's not a manhunt video if it's not a manhunt style video it will most likely get way less views than this minecraft 100 for survival now i found a clip of dream explaining like what he's planning to do his youtube the future of his channel and everything like that so let me show that to you and then we can talk about it more aren't you afraid you're gonna lose views after ending manhunt oh of course i'll lose views I mean, obviously my my non even when I was doing manhunt my non manhunt videos got less views than my manhunt videos I think we'll we'll do a reunion manhunt at some point we'll do an IRL manhunt at some point um and I'll do manhunt style content in terms of like intense you know like where we did hitman and stuff like I didn't say we're ending all those series so let's still do lots of cool stuff that will get good views and at the end of the day in my mind it's kind of like either you just pound out a series until it's like it's it's dead or you end it when it's still doing well and people are still really enjoying it and you don't ruin it. And so I'd rather, I'd rather have Manhunt have a, an awesome legacy and be, you know, from start to the end, an amazing series, than have it, you know, fall off and, and just be, be milked in, into oblivion. And like part of that as well is that I know that once I start doing IRL content and we're doing stuff in real life and we're all living together and, and I, I face reveal that I'm doing stuff and I'm traveling and all that stuff, I'll have a lot less time to like practice and be a good Minecraft player and, um, and I, I, and like plan things and stuff. And I feel like for Manhunt, it'll be, um, that, that's, that's a big part of Manhunt is me coming up with clever traps and understanding all the game mechanics and whatever. So we'll still do Manhunt, um, but it will be. You know, it'll be, it'll definitely be more. I mean, already right now, it's, it's, it was the most, like, manhunts have had space between, it. like, the most recent manhunt, I think, had like two and a half months or more between it and the previous one. And so, I'm assuming we'll do a, a manhunt in December or something for a little reunion. And I'm assuming we'll do an IRL manhunt, um, 
at some point before then or just after then. Um, and then, uh, yeah, obviously there'll be Manhunt style content. I was a lot of people commenting on my, my most recent video being like, this is the next series. Like, I'm like, no, it's not. It's just a cool concept. And like, if we, I mean, maybe I do it again down the line and do, do more floors or something and make it better and, and change it. That's always what you do. But it is just another, just another random idea I had. And I thought it'd be cool to try and we did it. It was fun. Um, it was structured weirdly. I think there was, there was things that could have been better. Um, I would have liked to have the floors change, like the look around. I, I, I didn't like that. It was the same look pretty much like the whole video. Um, and then food, you know, more food and stuff. I feel like we can improve that series, but I'll, and, and maybe do another one and make it a series. Um, but I also feel like that it was just a cool video I wanted to do. And there's a lot of cool stuff. Now, what he's saying here is very, very reasonable and it makes sense. After ending Manhunt, he has to kind of stick to the Manhunt style content. For example, like the Hitman or Death Swap or something like that. I know Death Swap isn't like really Manhunt style, but it is the same. It has a lot of intensity on it. And for example, he could bring back the ultimate tag as well. Because I feel like if he doesn't upload something that is kind of Manhunt style, like something super, super intense, he will slowly just actually just kill his channel because let's be honest if he continued making these weird kind of irrelevant challenges that is like a hundred floor survival obviously it's it, it was a cool video you know it's kind of a vibe but if we think about it in the long term it, that video will not do insanely well and get like 70 million views because that concept is just very it's just kind of basic there's no intensity on it obviously there was a bit of intensity but it's just killing mobs so what kind of an intensity can you even get there but yeah i really like what dream said honestly i love to hear that they will do like an actual reunion manhunt video later this year and a real life manhunt which probably will break the internet once again but i really just want to focus on the content he will make till then honestly i just hope he doesn't wait another like two months for an upload or something i kind of feel like dream has to upload like once once per month at least because you know come on bro i understood why it took so long between the manhunt videos because you know they take so so long to make and and they're most likely fully legit so to actually get those runs he got is borderline impossible that's why it took so long for him to actually make it but yeah honestly i just kind of want dream to upload manhunt style content for example i don't know he has to kill the wither or he has to get all the achievements done in a specific time while there's people hunting him or something like that because obviously it won't like i feel like it won't get like 70 million views but it will probably get above like i don't know 10 20 because you know it's just kind of his style it's just kind of what people like the most and i would love like any sort of manhunt style content like anything that includes the kind of manhunt vibe that would be perfect because that's what dreams brand is it's manhunt it's intense minecraft gameplay with just screaming and insane plays that people don't expect you know like right now dream is kind of falling off and i don't want him to become like oh just a minecraft you YouTuber, and then him getting like maybe like 3 million views per video that is just that is just not dream I can't imagine dream turning into something like that what dream for me right now is uploads maybe once a month some insane minecraft gameplay that gonna be relevant for like weeks and people are gonna talk about it and there's gonna be more hype like there was last year and honestly I feel like 2020 was kind of the prime of manhunt because he started the four hunter series and those were honestly I feel like his prime that was his prime for hunter manhunt videos were his prime when it came to manhunts honestly i'm just i have mixed emotions with this because i feel like dream can actually bring back his channel by just like making my manhunt style videos but honestly he can do whatever he wants i will still probably enjoy the videos he makes make like a reaction video that other people will enjoy but yeah it's really up to dream let me know what you think of this do you agree with my opinion or you have your own opinion well be sure to comment that down below and yeah that's it and i'm out